What's good YouTube? It's your man Rage King back with another one. Yes, another upload to the channel. And before we get started, I ask if y'all please go down there and hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that share button, and hit that bell for notifications if you're new. Welcome to Rumble Rage TV. This is how we do Rage and Rebels. Crown up. And if you're new to the crew, welcome to the Rage and Rebel Revolution. Now let's vibe. And y'all got some more news coming out of NBA 2K23. My team version, man. For the people out there that play my team, man, got some uh, got some news for y'all. We got this trailer for y'all for the my team part of the game, man. So y'all know what time it is. We're going to watch it. We're going to react to this how we do. All right, so without further ado, let's get into it. This is Josh Giddy introducing you to NBA 2K23's My Team Mode. This year, take more control than ever before on your journey to assembling Ooh. your very own dream team of the greatest NBA superstars. Okay. Let's take a look at what's coming to my team this year. Let's get to it. Seasons are returning in my team with more ways to progress and earn incredible rewards in every game mode on your way to level 40 and beyond. Okay. And with new seasons every six weeks, my team is always staying fresh. So every six weeks, new season, always staying fresh. Okay, I can get behind that. I can get behind that. Because I'm like this. I'm like this. I know a lot of people say, well, that's not really nothing new. So I'm like this with video games, bro. If you got something that works, and especially when you're making a yearly game like this one, when you got something that works, stick to it. Don't bring something new to the game that people like and then take it out. I can't stand that. But if you got something that works, stick to the formula, keep that in the game, and then add new things. If you got to add some new stuff in it, add in something new, see if the people like it. If they don't, then take it out. If they do, then keep it in, man. That's how you build a great game, all right? So I'm, I'm with this. I'm with it. This is one of those returning features I'm, I'm perfectly fine with. With more ways for you to play and take control of your journey, let's hit the triple threat courts to see what's new. Okay, the first triple time threat is back. Team, team up with your friends and your favorite cards in the brand new Triple Threat Online co-op. What? Triple Threat card? Look, I'm going to be honest with you, man. I didn't, I didn't kind of stay away from my team for a little bit, man, because certain features wasn't in it. You know what I mean? But if you're going to have a co-op on, on the Triple Threat courts, man, a, a co-op with the my team, hey, again, that's a dub. I call that me personally. I call that a dub. That's, that's one of those things you add in new that could actually work out. You know, you get them servers going right and everything like that, man. Hey, you brought you got something special on your hands. That's one of those new features, as I just alluded to. If it's new and it works, keep it. I think this is going to be one of them new features that actually works, man. Squad up with your friends to take on AI opponents to rise up your individual reward ladders or compete online to get great rewards as a team. And you can do it online. That's badass. a party game for bragging rights. If you're going solo, Triple Threat gets new rewards for new and experienced players each season. Mm -hmm. And Triple Threat Online returns to its classic roots in multiplayer action. All in all weekend warriors, oh, let's go back, let's go team. back, let's go back, let's go back. All one more time, weekend. one more time, my bad, yo. Old man reaction. So you got the current, the golden age the modern age, NBA champ tier, and the all-time tier. Okay, I'm cool with that. Okay, so you got tiers to it, too. Okay. All in all weekend warriors, My Team Limited is a fun, online competitive mode with lineup requirements requiring you to adapt and overcome each weekend with guaranteed rewards with every win. Plus Bro, I'm not even going to lie. It seemed like to me, it, it seemed like to me, maybe just to me, but it seemed like my team already, we ain't even halfway done with this video yet. And it seems like to me, my team gets a little bit more. They get a lot more love than the my career community. You understand what I'm saying? Like I get this is the. I mean, they both make they both make the game a lot of money, but I think they spend more time on my team because it makes them more money. Because I'm looking at this and they getting a whole bunch of stuff, bro. A whole bunch of stuff. You didn't see this many additions to the my career aspect of the game yet. Maybe that's coming, but seeing how they doing my team, bro, I'm not going to lie, my team community, I'm kind of jealous of y'all, bro. I'm kind of jealous. I ain't even going to care. Each time expands to both the multiplayer and single player experience. Multiplayer and, and single player line, clutch time. Five minutes on the clock and a 14 second shot clock is high intensity and fast paced mode is like nothing else in NBA 2K. 14 seconds shot clock? Are you insane? Bro, could you imagine playing full court basketball with a 14 second shot clock or is this half court? Either way, 14 second shot clock, that is insane, bro. Limited returns. Take your best lineup and compete to increase your season's points and rise up the leaderboard. All right. With even more rewards, prestige, and competition, 
Get ready to see how you rank against friends on the My Team community. Okay. New to 2K23's My Team, you can lock your control to a single player no matter if you are in domination, challenges, limited, or triple threat. Focus and... So since you can lock, and it's funny to me, I was just getting ready to say it. It's funny to me they say they bring in this feature where you can lock in and still unlock rewards and shit. But it's crazy to me. I was just getting ready to say, watch how many people. Because if you play online at all, in, in a in a team in a uh, like in regs or in, in the team part of the game, when you playing as the whole team, you notice how many people get on the center and just play defense with the center on defense especially. I was just gonna say, watch how many people character lock on the center this year, and in my team, and look where they showcasing centers. Being character locked in. They knew what they was doing right there. You ain't slick, 2K. You ain't slick. You ain't slick. And compete how you want. Finally, contracts are gone. Play and use the cards. That right there. That. Damn, I'm about ready to cry. That right there, that right there, other than it being pretty much pay to win, in most cases, that right there, the contract situation, was the number one reason why Rage King would never touch my team. I knew what it was, I'm aware of everything that it, you know, I'm aware of the rewards and how it works and everything like that, don't get me wrong, hell, I play 2K too, but contracts, what, in my opinion, were like that was that was like the epitome of greed right there. Cause it's like, why would you why would you punish me for working so hard to get this card, and then I can only have it for a limited time if I ain't got the right shit to put on the card? You understand what I'm saying? So no contracts in my team, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie. That 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 right there very well may have me playing my team this year. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm not even gonna lie. That right there. If anything else in this video so far, bro. That right there, no con, no more contracts. That's a dub for me, bro. That's a whole dub right there, man. I'm, I can't even lie, and it's about damn time. Keep it that way, 2K, please. Your collection, how you want. There's more ways to play, earn, build, and compete with your dream team in NBA 2K23, my team. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I'm not even going to lie. It seemed like I got a lot to look forward to in my team. Uh, I'm pretty sure, you know, I'm pretty sure it's still going to have a pay to win factor to it, of course. But with that being said, minus that, because every game is going to have a pay to win aspect. So let's just be honest. That's just what gaming is now. They all going to have a little skill based matchmaking. They all going to have a little pay to win mode at the very least, at least the mode that's pay to win. You know, as long as they can kick back on the pay to win part of the game, like they doing with the contracts and everything like that. From what I've seen in this trailer, man, this looks like a dub right here. It looks like my team is actually going to be worth the fun this year, man. But that's just my opinion. Y'all let me know down in the comment section what y'all think about the changes and the features that are being brought back to my team in 2K23, man. And are y'all getting it this year? As long as y'all remain respectful and logical, we can have a conversation. But that's the end of my video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. It's been a pleasure making it for you. My name is Rage King, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.